My name is Vincent Schofield, executive chef for a Sea Change restaurant in Minneapolis. Uh, I'm from San Francisco, California. Came up in a lot of farm to table restaurants, uh, ocean to table restaurants, and have tried to continue that philosophy throughout my career. I've worked in a lot of places around the country and around the world, and always try to stick to the philosophy that knowing where our food comes from, knowing where our fish comes from, Knowing the farmer who raised the pig and the cow is a very, very important part of the dining experience. It's important for my chef, for my cooks as cooks, and for the guest as a whole. So Sea Change, um, you know, I've been here five months, but the background and the history of Sea Change has obviously always been a sustainable seafood restaurant. Um, definitely one of the pioneers in Minneapolis or in the Midwest, uh, a very forward-thinking restaurant at the time, you know, bringing sustainable seafood to the Midwest. You know, we're landlocked here in the middle of Minnesota, but uh, making sure that the product that we get is pristine and fantastic is obviously super important. We try to source product, especially fish, um, all the way knowing where the boat that it came from, uh, having a great relationship with our vendors, and really focusing on simple, delicious food uh, made with high quality ingredients executed correctly in a beautiful environment. So some of our menu items include a trolley sole, um, American squid, branzino, Arctic char, all sustainable, some farm, some wild product. Um, chef, I believe that when you have great products, not overworking it and keeping it simple is the most important thing. Um, one of my favorite dishes on the menu right now is a uh, American braised squid in tomato sauce with some squid ink. Petrali sole, um, romesco, a little broccolini, breadcrumbs, and olive oil. Simple, fantastic, um, it's an ode to Spain. I, to me, those flavors mesh very, very well together. I, I love that kind of earthy tomato, um, fishy is not the right word, but just a beautifully tasting squid uh, that's not fried. You know, I think fry, uh, fried squid calamari is delicious, but we want it to treat it a little bit differently here, so we braise it in the tomato and squid ink. Uh, the Brenzito dish that we do is very simple to cauliflower puree, raisins, capers, sauteed mushrooms, brown butter, obviously uh, pan seared um, Brenzino, uh, grilled lemon, and dill. Simplicity, uh, it's a very Mediterranean dish. Um, those are some of the dishes that we have on the menu right now that I think are fantastic. Uh, obviously, we have an octopus dish that's been on here since day one. Um, Spanish octopus, obviously a very sustainable product. So, oysters, a myriad of other dishes, but uh, those are definitely some of my favorites and some of the ones I enjoy cooking. When I first obviously moved here, I did not know many vendors. I, I was out there looking and uh, since, you know, Sea Change already had a great relationship with a lot of vendors. Coastal has been a fantastic purveyor for us. Uh, Chris has been an amazing resource for me. He brings in fishermen, uh, you know, who are out there doing the job that we need done so we can have this beautiful pristine product on our plate uh, to come talk to us and to show us the product and to, you know, teach our cooks and to have a relationship with them, which I think is fantastic. Um, Fortune overall has been our number one seafood, seafood purveyor and absolutely couldn't ask for, for a better one. You know, they're, they're, they're second to none. Um, I've been to their facility, I've seen what they do. It's always been a joy to just speak to, to them on a daily basis and talk about product and what we can do to get more sustainable product in, how can we use bycatch in a different way. So it's always been fun and it's a very, it's a very great relationship for me and I, I learn every day from, uh, from the team at Fortune. As far as the future of Sea Change goes, I think um, I'd like to use more product that is considered bycatch. I think there's a lot of, I think as consumers, uh, as Americans, we, we want our salmons and our whitefish and our tunas, and they're all fantastic and great, but to really be a sustainable seafood restaurant, we need to look beyond what everyone else is using. You know, how can we use uh, a less recognized fish and bring it to the masses? And I think that's definitely the direction we'd like to take some of the menu items for sea change. And working with Fortune is just gonna be you know, a part of that and it's gonna be an awesome experience. So please come down and see Change and join us for dinner or lunch anytime. We'd love to see you. Thank you so much.